Welcome back, everybody. You're Into going to the galaxy. We go. We're probably going to the planet Helim. Helim. <laughs> Not sure how to say it. <laughs> What's this one? Galen. You're not whatever the planet is. <laughs> F-O. F-O-U. These are the most Star Wars sounding planets we've encountered yet. <laughs> and not enough apostrophes. There she be. Yeah. You're right, they do have a lot of apostrophes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think they've seen you? Nah. <laughs> They're probably talking about some other ship. What if the probe you sent down landed, like, right in front of them? <laughs> Mercenary activity detected. Oh my god. Let's go make some money. <laughs> Let's go steal from more thieves. <laughs> I'm like Robin Hood. <laughs> Except I don't give to the poor. Yeah. I keep for myself. <laughs> let's go with Grunt. And, yeah, let's get some hot dogs. <laughs> Krogan's love hot dogs. <laughs> it's Sand Planet. Oh, my God. <laughs> we should have brought Jacob. It's his home. <laughs> We'll make sure to bring some rats back for him. <laughs> Imagine opening up like a bag of Lay's. <laughs> it's just a bunch of... Oh, there they are! Oh my god! <laughs> but it's just a bunch of rats and he just starts chowing down. <laughs> oh, there's never enough rats in these. It's all air. <laughs> it's funny, everyone complains about that. But like, would you rather just have a bag of chip crumbs <laughs> yeah the cargo ship docked and received a large shipment I got a large shipment for you right here hey <laughs> hey baby <laughs> hey uh, wide load coming true <laughs> <laughs> imagine like a stereotypical like New Yorker type guy who's like really fat and he just owns it like that. Just hey, wide load coming through, make way. Hey, <laughs> let's go to the delicatessen and get some red meat. <laughs> some red meat, <laughs> some rats. <laughs> you haven't fought Eclipse in a long time, yeah. Take it! <laughs> Damn. Jeez, Grunt. Hey, save hey. it for when you're on your own. Yeah. Eclipse. I mean, not, maybe not like completely on your own, because then there's no one to take it. <laughs> <laughs> They're throwing up! I threw my shields! You might want to shoot it. Uh, there you go. Uh, okay. <laughs> I was just trying not to die. <laughs> <laughs> That's the way it came. You're the wolf. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice. Hey. Wide load coming through. <laughs> I got a large amount of cog cargo and I need somewhere to dock. <laughs> Feud. <laughs> the feud. The feud. <gasps> We're playing the feud. <laughs> <laughs> it turns out that's the like main boss of the game, Steve Harvey. <laughs> Escort civilians to crew quarters. Hell yeah, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I got a work area you can return to, baby. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> Excuse me, Eclipse. Do any of you have any hot dogs? 
I'm here to kick ass and cook hot dogs. And I'm all out of ass. <laughs> You'll never find me here. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, more stomach viruses. <laughs> Another heart attack. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Watch for fire. Wait, what kind of fire, though? <laughs> that kind. <gasps> oh, God. Poor fire, yeah. yeah. Yeah, boy. <laughs> I can press buttons now. <laughs> My groin! <laughs> Imagine if you shot someone in the dick, and their like last words as they like plummet to the ground is like, "My ass!" <laughs> How many questions would you have that you could never get answered because they died? <laughs> Does it make me a terrible person that I would want to ask those kinds of questions to like a World War II vet? <laughs> How many hilarious deaths did you witness? <laughs> Yeah, like, I know, I know they say war is hell, so did anyone ever try to, like, lighten things up a little? <laughs> you yeah. know, did, did you know anybody that held that grenade for a little too long? <laughs> Were people, like, yelling their favorite catchphrases from all the, like, radio shows? <laughs> Front Night! <laughs> yeah, was anyone quoting famous 1940s radio show Fright Night? <laughs> I think you're looking for a computer. I can't remember. Oh, okay. Oh, that might. Oh, that's it there. Mainframe. Oh. Hack the mainframe, Rob. Yeah, I did it. <laughs> I hacked the mainframe. It's a Unix system. <laughs> I know this. <laughs> Location of last report from Ter Allen is encrypted. Oh my god. It's decrypting. Oh my god. What do we I do? Survive. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was, I was just gonna say, like, oh, this is gonna be easy. <laughs> Surviving's easy when there's nothing to challenge that survival. <laughs> I, I want to see a game like that. Like, your mission? Survive. And it just like puts you in a room. <laughs> You're in like an insane asylum or something with so a padded room. <laughs> I want to play a game like that where the mission is to like kill yourself. <laughs> but they make it really hard. Yeah, it's like surgeon simulator controls. <laughs> yeah. What are you guys doing all the way over there? Oh, there's enemies. <laughs> grunt died. Oh no, Grunt. Imagine killing a Krogan and it just gets back up. <laughs> Damn, Zora, you really need to pick your spots. <laughs> Get him. Captain Vorlian. <laughs> Too late. Now you're dead. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I've never really seen him from behind run like that. <laughs> that was cool. It, it was kind of adorable. <laughs> Imagine a Krogan running like that after an ice cream truck. <laughs> 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 the guy looks in the rearview mirror and it's it's just like the scene from Jurassic Park. <laughs> the ice cream's all rippling. <laughs> <laughs> How's that happening? <laughs> Oh, do 
script incomplete. <laughs> yeah, go back to the computer. No! <laughs> Decrypted, oh, no. The decrypted data is incomplete. Further details are required to trace Ter Allen's location. The data has been sent to Cerberus for further analysis. Cerberus? I hate those guys. The people you currently work for. They suck. Friday! <laughs> we got him a good big bag of rats. <laughs> You know, uh, Jacob, I, I, I realize like these are part of your culinary traditions, but I really didn't think you'd eat only the bones. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> so he pulls the bones out of the rat? <laughs> Just sucks them right out. <laughs> Imagine if the rat was still alive. <laughs> So it's just like a mostly flat thing just laying there. <laughs> Poor rat. <laughs> so I assume go to like the mass relay or something and you'll see your next objective. Oh, maybe check your messages. <clears throat> oh, okay. Maybe you have to do a mission or two and then Surfers will be like, we decrypted it. Oh, maybe. Maybe that's what it is. Alright. So I'll just send you on a different one then. Wow. <laughs> Here I am, master of the galaxy. <laughs> Go to the Hourglass Nebula. Yeah. Like that figure you got, Shepard. Damn. That's right, I'm a nebula type. <laughs> I have detected an anomaly. An anomaly? What's that? I don't like the sound of an anomaly. Nature of incident is not recorded. Assistance is requested. General distress. User unregistered or record damaged. Launched. Something on our sensors. Alliance hotspot? It's the hottest club in town. <laughs> this planet. God, imagine an entire planet that's just a giant nightclub. <laughs> Damn, dude, what if we made Earth that? It's a crashed ship. Wow. Don't leave me! <laughs> I shouldn't have let Zaid pilot it! <laughs> so I can't remember what you're looking for, but you want to find an item here? Okay. Saying is, I have to find an explosive. <laughs> I think this is supposed to be some like ancient. Like this is kind of like the Titanic of spaceships. It went missing, and you just found it. Cool. I bet it's down here. Oh, I remember what you got to do. I think. Pull out your gun. Aim it at the left of you. Up a bit. And you got to shoot. See the thing on the right that's like rocking back and forth? That. Oh, I see. I think you got to shoot that, but I think you got to shoot it from up top. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so I actually want to create. <laughs> well. Yeah, now you can probably shoot it. Oh, I see. <laughs> I 
There, now you made a bridge. Oh, cool. In the safest way possible. <laughs> Is that not how bridges are normally built? <laughs> they are in Atlantis. <laughs> no. That's the only scene from that whole movie I actually remember. And they're like, oh, it must have taken thousands of years for them to make this beautiful architecture. And then the one guy just blows up a pillar and falls over the cliff. Hey, look, I made a bridge. <laughs> it only took me, what, like 30 seconds? And I, I really liked that movie. I, li I didn't like it when I was when I first saw it. Mm -hmm. And then I saw it again, like, I don't know, probably like seven or eight years ago. And I was like, oh, that was really good. <laughs> Apparently that was like one of the movies that kind of killed 2D animation for Disney for a while. Mm. Just because it like flopped. You want to yeah, you climb up that? Yeah. Ah. Uh, I actually almost believe the conspiracy theory that Disney sabotaged all those movies themselves. Yeah. I I could kind of see that. Hey, look at this. <laughs> You're floating. And I... Oh. Can you not walk? No. Try putting your gun away. Oh. Uh, hit select, I think. <laughs> I can make the motions now. <laughs> Try walking towards the that ledge there. Oh, there yeah. we go. Yeah! Hooray! But yeah, like, there's all kinds of things. Like, I don't remember the exact movies, but it's something like, um, Treasure Planet came out on, like, a Wednesday, mm. which movies don't normally do. Yeah. And, like, Friday before it was Pirates of the Caribbean, and the Friday <laughs> after it was, like, Harry Potter. <laughs> like, it, it was just, like, they picked the worst times, and they used it as justification for their investors as to, like, why they shouldn't do 2D anymore. <laughs> That's creepy. Oh. Did you not notice the ship leaning? Oh, no, not really. I thought you were talking about, like, the flashing red like, light. Turn there. to your left. Just turn the camera to your left. And just stop. When you were walking, all those mountains were doing this. Oh. With my arms in real life. I'm moving them up and down. <laughs> for those of you who... Uh, oh, there they go. <laughs> Yeah, let's go add weight to the front of this thing. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Oh, oh Jesus. <laughs> I gotta go get that iridium. Wow. 500 iridium. Oh boy. That was the big treasure they were trying to protect. <laughs> oh, that is what I wanted to do. <laughs> I, I like how Shepard just doesn't react to the drop at all. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. Cerberus took away my ability to feel fear. <laughs> but not my ability to feel passion, Garrus. <laughs> In fact, they only enhanced that <laughs> for some reason. It's probably something like that you gotta do. Yeah. Meanwhile, everyone's like screaming at their computer screens. <laughs> oh, huh? The, the on your right, those are the stairs you fell down. You can go the opposite way, like left. That the bridge. Uh, You're on it now. Yeah. These these are what you fell down on, but you weren't facing this direction. Right. So if you look that way. 
Probably something you can do up here. Ooh. No problem. You made oh, it. Well, yeah, this is what I was thinking. Hooray. Let's hack into their mainframe. Let's hack into everybody's mainframe. Is the age you came back? <laughs> I knew you liked me, Zed. He just lands the ship on top of you. <laughs> I have detected an anomaly. Hooray! A crude base established on the planet's surface. The blood pack. Oh, damn. There's gonna be lots of Vortia. <laughs> I am detecting a large power source inside the base. It is probable that destroying it would disrupt the entire facility. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> You'll get your resources <laughs> when you fix this damn door! <laughs> this place sounds like it's full of life. Yay! A data pack. Somebody's diary? I'm sending back two of the Vorcha you sent me so that they could you could see what I'm doing with <laughs> Oh damn, this dude said piss. <laughs> Come on guys, let's go find the piss talker. <laughs> Whatever he speaks. <laughs> He pees? <laughs> no. <laughs> Piss comes out of his mouth. <laughs> Not even like when he opens his mouth for any other reason. <laughs> Only talking. <laughs> it's like all of a sudden, just for that moment, <laughs> he has urine for saliva. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> it tastes so bad. <laughs> oh, so you know what it tastes like. <laughs> so you're one of those guys. <laughs> yeah, I want to live forever. <laughs> like Martin Sheen. <laughs> you know what the funniest thing about the whole, like, urine as a natural remedy thing is? Hmm. They specifically, a lot of them will use aged urine. <laughs> so they keep it? Yeah, they just like keep it in jars and it gets all like weird and dark. <laughs> and they're like, ah, this will cure my cancer. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, as Garm. <laughs> Garm! <laughs> 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 I haven't seen that in a long time. Yeah. And it also involved piss in a mouth. <laughs> Guys, we aren't this kind of channel. <laughs> I don't know, maybe we are, but not on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're gonna die. Die of bullets. Ha, got him. Nice line, Shepard. I'll fire what? in your hole. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I got it. More like he's got it. <laughs> By which I mean a dead body. <laughs> By which I mean his own. <laughs> Hope you don't. <laughs> Blow up. 
Hope you don't mind dying in a. Oh, I guess not. <laughs> You're not a door. You just look like a door. Why would you do that? You lied to me. You fucking wall looks <laughs> like a door. What is this, Wily e. Coyote? <laughs> a ledge. Miranda, get off this ledge. <laughs> it's not safe. <laughs> Don't push me off this. Oh, it is a door. Oh, now it's a door. Miranda, did you make the door not a door? <laughs> Was it just to spite me? Miranda, is your stash in here? <laughs> Do it, now. it is. A containment cell. <laughs> full of crack. <laughs> Cut loose. Damn. Better call Luska Doctor for my comrade who's dead. Hey, get away! <laughs> <laughs> That's Thane. Are you sure? <laughs> He knows enough to not get shot anyway. After you brought him back. <laughs> I I didn't see him die. You can't say for sure that he died of getting shot. Let's take a closer look. Maybe it was that disease. Oh yeah. My Keppel syndrome is kicking in right now. <laughs> Thane, is it because you were shot in the lung? No! It's got nothing to do with it. I can never be shot. Is there a... Is there a thing here? Try using a... Yeah, I guess just try shooting him. Alright. Well, that did something. Let's keep doing things. <laughs> what if it killed you? <laughs> Damn, before I even got a single sip of gasoline. I'm trying to evacuate. <laughs> but I want that gasoline! <laughs> I'm thirsty! <laughs> When Cerberus rebuilt me, they made me run on gas! <laughs> this should come in handy. You can just go to the elusive event. Uh, we didn't do that. <laughs> Shut up, Martin Sheen! <laughs> if you could drink your own piss, then I can drink <laughs> gasoline! <laughs> I've drank so much that my piss is gasoline. <laughs> well, it seems we've both got something the other wants. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we can reach some sort of an agreement. <laughs> you piss in my mouth, I piss in yours. <laughs> uh, yeah, just oh, go back to the mass <laughs> Yeah, That is where the mass relay was. <laughs> you know, one of those classic types of agreements. Disable the blood pack relay. Yes, we'll just... 69 piss at each other. <laughs> It'll be grand. <laughs> I bet someone watching this is doing that right now. <laughs> yeah, we see you two. Yeah. I mean, if you're having fun and you're both into it, then go for it, but <laughs> it's a little awkward for Rob and I to see. Yeah, I mean, like, why are you right here in the room? <laughs> you don't why even- are, you don't even live here. Why are we right outside your window? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that- that was pretty fucked up of you guys to piss in each other's mouths when we're right- when we're visiting you. <laughs> Maybe oh, there it is. Tarth. Oh. I want to go to the purple one. 
anomaly. Can you detect an anomaly on the purple one? <laughs> like the fact that it's purple? Launched. I have found something. Someone's not leaving this planet alive. <laughs> What if they both leave and you don't? <laughs> well, she did say someone wasn't going to leave here alive. It was a good idea to be camouflaged for this planet, Rob. <laughs> now the frogs can find me. Stop chipping away at this node! There's nothing left here to mine. Move to the other sites now. Damn. Is that how you talk to your employees? To look up? Uh, to your right. Uh, more to your right. Uh... Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. As the beacon you turned on, it's shining in the direction you want to go. Oh, I see. Just follow the frogs. Toxic atmosphere. Yourself. Don't tell me what to do. I'm the commander. <laughs> I'm the command tin. <laughs> the Capitan Mader. <laughs> Hello. Bye. <laughs> it was nice to meet you. Shame about your untimely demise <laughs> in my hand. <laughs> Calm down. Jeez. It's just a few gunshots. <laughs> Do you have any idea how many of those I've had? Just walk it off. <laughs> That's what I did. Hit RB. <laughs> Use fortify, you <laughs> stupid bug. <laughs> God, don't you bugs even know how to use fortify? This is why humans are the apex predators. <laughs> And not just from Earth. We're the apex predator of the Milky Way. Yeah. This is why there are more species of humans than any other kind of animal. <laughs> Don't set me on fire. Setting people on fire is our thing. Why are you being so rude? Why are you both so rude? God. You did it. Hooray. I thought you were gonna die. <laughs> so did I. <laughs> What else could be lurking in this fog? I hope it's not more bugs. Raw material. Platinum. Damn. Germanium. <laughs> Platypus. <laughs> I wonder how many times we've made that joke and how many people get the reference. Yeah. I feel like there's probably, well, I, I don't know. It's like Corner Gas was pretty big at the time. It aired in America, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I think it's one of those things where there's like a few hardcore fans in the US. Oh, am right. I... oh okay. So I am stupid. <laughs> This way. Back down into the fog. Oh no. 
I hope I don't run into any oogly boogly. Great googly moogly. Oh no, it's the ferocious beast! <laughs> there he is! <laughs> That's the sound he made! <laughs> they should reboot that show, but the ferocious beast is one of these. <laughs> Maggie and the ferocious beast in nowhere land. <laughs> <laughs> It's one of those, except it still has the weird human nose. <laughs> Behind you. Behind me. Oh, there it is. That's the one that was already on. Yeah, there it is. No, no, that's the way you came. What? Is what I meant. See, there you go. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Make it to the end? Oh, well, maybe not. <laughs> I don't trust all these frogs I can hear. <laughs> They're plotting something. <laughs> They're gonna turn on me sometime. Just like Pippi Longstocking's horse. <laughs> Oh no, it's the boss. The boss? Boss is here, back to work. <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> You're hired. You're fired. Oh, oh my there god. He goes. <laughs> Jack. <laughs> I'm afraid all year. <laughs> I'm just gonna stay here. <laughs> Can you hack it? No. Bob the Builder. Didn't they like reboot Bob the Builder with a weird art style change? Probably, they reboot everything. Especially with a weird art style change. <laughs> <laughs> blink, blink. Good, now that whale ship won't destroy Earth. <laughs> hey, they rebooted the Powerpuff Girls and one of the writers put himself in an episode so that one of the, like, small children that Star Ant could have a crush on him. Wow. <laughs> I, I, okay, I made that sound like a... <laughs> by small children, I meant like one of the actual Powerpuff Girls in the episode has a crush on his character. Uh. I, I don't want to like actually accuse anyone of anything. <laughs> <laughs> well, on that note... <laughs> <laughs> on that note, please don't sue. <laughs> we'll see you guys next time. Unsued, hopefully.